Yeah, people, in this tutorial, I want to teach you how to make a album video art from an album cover art in FL Studio. So stick around. Please remember to share, like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. First, you want to go to FL Studio. Next, you want to go to the Mixer Channel Rock. Next, you want to go to an insert. And in your plugin, there's a thing called Visual. You go to Visual, there's another thing called Z Game Editor Visualizer. So you click E Game Editor Visualizer. Now, now you get a editing screen, right? Alright, the next thing you want to do is you want to add your track for your, your album cover art. Alright. So now we're gonna select this and put it to number one insert. Go back to channel rack. In your channel rack you're gonna go to add and you're gonna go to add pictures. In add pictures, I'm gonna use the last picture I used in the last tutorial how to make an album cover art. I'm gonna put a link in the description if, if you wanna watch that one. So I'm gonna go to download and I'm gonna find my cover art. There's a lot of ways you can do this, but I'm gonna do it my simple way. And I'm going to click on none here and I'm going to go to effects and I'm going to go to image. So now my picture that I just uploaded, I can just go to here where it said image, click none and here's my image. So now I'm going to just do some things with this image and make it a different style my own style so i'm gonna stretch this wide and i'm gonna add with this plus you add layer and what a layer is when you press plus you can add a next effects or background whatsoever so now i'm gonna add some blur to this background and i'm gonna adjust the amount to full now i'm gonna clone this like five times just to get more blur so what you want to do is this little arrow here you want to click it and you clone layer clone layer clone layer and look at this image it's getting more blur as i clone the layer so clone layer clone layer okay now this arrow down here you can use it to adjust your screen or go down to your next your next layer that you want to add so now you're gonna click add layer in this layer i'm gonna add a background so click on none and go background and i'm gonna add a fog machine see smoke you can also change the color smoke by going to the brush icon here click the brush icon and there are a lot of different color options so you click any color you want so i'm gonna go with red for now you can also use this to adjust how bright you want the red to be or how dark you want it to be also you can adjust it to white or black screen but anyway i'm gonna use this red now if you look at the smoke it's a different color right so now i'm gonna add another layer and now i'm gonna add uh wave effects so i'm gonna go to none and go to peak effects and i'm gonna use linear 
and then I'm gonna adjust and over here is your toolbar sorry so you're gonna use these to adjust where you want it to go so I'm gonna put it at 50% and over here you can see the percent when I move this here position so position that to 50% now it's in the middle so if you press play what's gonna happen is this see okay so now I can do different things to the wave and make it of different shapes right different color also so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look for I'm gonna scroll down polarity and I'm gonna make it 50% also also gonna change the color and I'm also gonna change the power of the wave signal I'm also gonna change from from bar to curve You can go even more steps and adjust all these things you want to adjust. another layer where I'm gonna just I'm just gonna add up the image so you're gonna you, you go to none and you go to image now you had your yeah this image here you're gonna change it to something different so you're gonna use your album cover right so you go to none and you select your photo you can change your size right you also can change like the width and all those stuff but I'm just gonna leave it there also to give it some more play or movements you click none you click the yeah none and you find this thing called audio shake so now we have audio moving you don't want it like that so you're gonna turn down the amount this this beat here in the background is not far discovered I'm just using this for an example so now you have your covered video moving to your beat or to your song and you can go more advanced but I'm just gonna leave it at that if you want to see more advanced details you can leave a com comment in the comment section now you just export and you export to whatever you want to export it to 4k 5k youtube I have Insta, I have Insta Story, TikTok, Facebook, Facebook Story. I normally go with the 4K YouTube and then I 
probably change the name, change the location to your desktop in your name. it out. It's gonna render down, right? Eh? 